about it. So we had quite a night tonight with uh, all the kids out there doing their trick or treating and uh, uh, you know, we had a nice day out there for the most part, but it looks like things are changing, Joseph. Yeah, it was one of uh, 11 dry days that we had this month, yeah. uh, this October. We had a pair of dry days this weekend, uh, which is really nice. You can see how the month of October wrapped up. So for Halloween, it was very pleasant, just a little breezy, a little chilly out there tonight. But this is how the month kind of broke down and... And this is what we saw over the last uh, few days. We had a couple dry days. You can see that represented by the orange blocks there. And then each day that was green, we brought in rain. And that was that gloomy stretch that we had. Uh, again, the last sunny days that we had was the 15th and the 16th there, which were a couple dry days as well. And this is where we kind of wrapped up the month as far as our rain total went. So, yeah, today was uh, one of the few dry days that we had this month. It was more wet than it was dry. There's no doubt about it. But we needed that rain trying to catch up to that drought and those conditions that we have going on across the Pacific Northwest. Some locations did have some improvements, but we could still use some more rain. And the Climate Prediction Center is thinking, hey, we may see a wetter than normal November coming our way. And I can tell you this, the, at least the first part of our November, the first week, is going to feel a little wet. As far as temperatures go, this is what they believe with uh, the temperature outlook for the month of November. Warmer than normal down to the south, and maybe the far eastern side of Oregon, but the rest of the state's probably an equal chance, so we may be a little cool, we may be a little warmer right around average. November kind of plays out like this. We start off November right around the upper 50s. So today at 61 degrees, we were above average by a few degrees. Uh, when we get to tomorrow, the average high is 57. By the time we wrap up the month, it's 49. Not as dramatic as our October. October really goes from feeling pretty good to feeling chilly like it may have this evening. All right, area of low pressure to the northwest there. We have plenty of moisture moving in our direction that arrives early tomorrow morning, 6 to 7 a.m. I would expect the clouds following up, uh, followed up with some rain pretty quick right after those clouds start to move on in. We've had those gloomy days. That was all rain there. And then we had that broken sky a little bit on Friday night, and then we had a nice sunny sky yesterday and today. Rain chances Monday through Friday are well, at least 50% or above. I think the dry time is going to come maybe at times on Tuesday and the start Wednesday. Then we'll have to watch Friday as well. Future cast shows that front moving on in as we go into tomorrow morning. There's the clouds, there's the rain. Sticks around through most of the day, although I think by about the evening hours, closer to dinner time, we may break through those clouds and we may dry up a bit. Uh, by the time we head into Tuesday morning, we're still cloudy. This is the second part of a system that's going to be moving on in, and that's going to bring in the rain later in the day on Tuesday. So I think the first part, maybe the first couple of hours of your morning should be pretty dry, heading to about lunchtime. Wednesday is fairly dry till the evening hours, okay? So I'm just telling you the little moments where we should have some dry moments. Uh, Thursday looks like it's going to be a washout, though. I think we're going to see rain for most of the day on Thursday. And then again, Friday night. Really busy week. But I'll tell you this, tomorrow's going to be paired with the wind as well. So just keep that in mind. Temperatures at 60 degrees on Wednesday, Thursday 58. Then we cool down to the 50s on Friday. Tomorrow, Wayne, just wet and cool. And windy. And windy. <laughs> All right. When we come back, tonight 